Hey guys, it's Brad here from Get Out There Gear Reviews, and today I'll be testing and reviewing the Hotcore Mantis 2. This is a two-person, three-season tent with dual vestibules. I'll be off on a couple of long canoe trips to put this tent to the test. Weighing in at a packed weight of 6.1 pounds, the Hotcore Mantis 2 is one of Hotcore's newest adventure tents. Stowing it in our gear bags, we hit the water and portages to see how the tent performed in the wilderness. Setup is quick and easy, thanks to the unique Mantis pole system. This one-piece pole system uses shock corded sections and three strategic hubs that allow for simple and quick setup. Constructed of 9.5 millimeter aluminum with locking tips, the pole is both lightweight and durable. The pole is clipped into the four corners before being clipped to the tent. Without the fly, the Mantis has plenty of mesh, allowing for ample airflow or viewing the night sky on warmer nights. A great feature of the Mantis is the polyester rain fly and vestibule, coated in polyurethane. Hotcore claims the fabric is tough enough to withstand hurricane downpours, and while we didn't camp in a hurricane, we did have several rainstorms where the interior of the tent was nice and dry. Hotcore also produces the Mantis in a larger three-man version, and unlike some tents, Hotcore's tents comfortably fit the amount of people they were designed for. Lying down in the Mantis 2, you'll find plenty of room for two people and some gear. This is a true two-man tent, comfortably accommodating two individuals with an interior dimension of 2.2 meters length by 1.4 meter width. There's ample space to hold gear in the tent, with side gear pouches and an overhead gear loft. Well, I've been pretty impressed with the Hotcore Manus 2. Hotcore's done a good job at delivering a tent suitable for backpacking and canoeing. There's a lot of positive with the tent. The dual vestibules and two doors make it really good if you're camping with two people. So you both have a place to store your own gear and you both have a way to get out of the tent without climbing over each other. There's ample storage inside the tent with extra gear lofts and mesh side pockets. Only one little downside is it's a little on the heavier side compared to other backpacking and canoeing tents. But if you're looking for an affordable and versatile tent, look no further than the Hotcore Manus 2. For Get Out There Gear Reviews, I'm Brad Jennings. <music>